Finally, it is done. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Vault Hunters. So today in this episode, as the very first thing that I want to do is first of all say we are very, very low on emeralds. But with that said though, there is one specific task that I'm going to prioritize over anything else. And that is basically getting this dungeon quest complete. I want to get to these things right here. Uh, obviously, I can't get level 40 right away, but I can get to the archives and plug cross pearl, which would be really cool. Also, I wouldn't mind getting a park. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and... Should I... Actually, I, I was about to say, should I put unbreaking on it? But I can't. Um, this on the... Oh. <laughs> oh. Um, yeah, that's... I don't think I have that, unfortunately. Hello? Where is... Oh, wow. Hi. Um... Yeah, you get that? Wow, okay, that actually happened. Okay, anyway, uh, as I was saying, this time we should probably select a bounce. Yes, find... Okay, I'm actually going to take this because I do want to run a scavenger vault after running this one. Like, this one I'm running here, I'm not adding anything. I'm just hunting for dungeons and I'm not even going to loot until I find a dungeon door. Um... <laughs> Submit one iron hot What? We have an iron horse armor. It couldn't have been an, a gold one it was requiring, huh? Yeah, we're gonna reroll that. Oh, wow. That is pretty much back to back. You know what? Again, I'm gonna take it. Uh, so we're not gonna actually complete any bounties in this specific run, but that is totally fine. Oh, that's my vanilla sword. I forgot. I think anyway. Wait, which one of these? That's 1122. That's... No, wait. That's... that's This is a lot better. I should not be running with that. <laughs> <laughs> Oopsie. Uh, right, let's remember to actually get the pacifist vial this time. And I think that that is everything. Uh, yeah, all right, let's go through and let's do this. All right, it is a monolith vault. Again, I'm not going to focus on the objective whatsoever. We do, however, have plus 100% soul shards, so that's not too bad. I mean, that's that's pretty decent. But again, all I'm here for is to find a dungeon door. And then I will pretty much be happy. I mean, I'll loot, I'll, I'll, I'll loot the rest of the vault, but yeah, not until I actually find a dungeon door. I mean, I'll, I'll get the monolith if I run past it, and I will also run for my life when it is endangered. Yeah, that okay, this is gonna be interesting, isn't it? Uh, champion. Okay. Yeah. Um. Hmm. By the way, should I mention that I'm not warmed up yet? <laughs> Oh dear me. And what? I think I'm good to call this room cleared and, uh, yep, do that. Oh dear me. Before I forget. Right. Yeah, that's. Excuse me. You, you guys have. Okay, this vault is a lot more dangerous than I expected it to be. Hi. Hey, fellas. Please go away. That's. Uh, very unfortunate. Get that. Jump down. Oh boy. Yes, found one. Okay, actually that didn't take that long. I just had to run through quite a few rooms. <laughs> that actually wasn't too bad. Wow, nice. I am very, very happy. That also means that I can actually complete the monolith here. Challenging, you have completed a quest. Now I could say, you know what, I'm happy and uh, leave, but um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna do that, am I? Oh dear me. Okay, here we go. I mean, I can bail immediately, right? I can bail immediately. Um, okay, actually, this might actually be... Do you know what? Actually, I'm not gonna chicken out on this. I'm not gonna... I'm keep getting cornered a little bit, but I'm I'm not chickening out on this. These are ornate chests. These are good. Yep, be gone. Come on. The sword is powerful. I'm powerful. You're nothing. You're nothing to me. There we go. See? Yeah, so it's okay. Yeah, this is... Oh, <laughs> yeah, these... Also, I've learned that the more challenging these rooms are, uh, the better the loot, apparently. So, considering this is challenging, we should get some pretty decent stuff from this, I hope. I mean, I can tell already now we are, so... Oh, wow. Chestplate. Okay, yep. <laughs> 
this is good. Uh, that's a death trap waiting to happen. Right, let's take it one bit at a time here. Get all of this good stuff. Nice. What is that? Flesh block? Oh, fi finely butchered. Okay. Uh, apparently, there's no natural way down here, so that's fun. Um, oh, there's the ladder there. Uh, at least there's not a boss. Then I would have been worried. Maybe. Hmm. I'm thinking of actually. I don't have. <laughs> I don't have strength to the max yet, do I? Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Please don't want to die like this. That would be bad. Very bad. Very bad. Okay. Everything's fine. Everything. Oh dear. Everything's not fine. <laughs> Definitely gotta re re regen before I take that on. That's for sure. Doing some more of this pacifist vial. Uh, okay. Okay. It's it's just it's just one champion. It's one champion. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Use this. Oh, you drive a hard bargain. You drive a very hard bargain. Please. Please just go away. Oh, okay. Worth it though. That was actually not too bad. This could have been a lot worse, but this. This has really, really been worth it. Oh, hi. We're hiding. Don't hide. All right. Nice. Okay. Now I can just focus on getting all the monoliths and then. Oh, well, we actually just completed a challenging. Uh, a, chal a challenging. Uh, I forgot the word of them. The dungeon, dungeon. There we go. I guess I might as well get some ores here while I'm at it. Oh, void miner. Okay, my timer is ticking here, but the amount of blocks mined is lower. That would actually be really, really cool. It would mean that if I do find something that I want, like a block that I actually really want, then I can't actually take it with that set pickaxe. But still. I do like the sound of that. Huh, I'm gonna think about that, because, uh, yeah, that's not too bad. Oh, wow. Oh, this is some good stuff. Didn't get that very good one, though, but oh, well. Yep. Yeah, I, th I think this is worth the stop. <laughs> oh, dear me. Uh, right. Yeah, I, I do need to work on my storage uh, situation when it comes to my satchels, but for now it gets the job done. So I do want to make another one for some other purposes as well. Like an empty one just to catch all of these things right here so they're not in my actual inventory. That would be nice because this is already full. So maybe making one just for Vault Armor and Vault, vault Gear because I realize now that I've actually gotten quite a bit of it. So that would probably be beneficial. Another ore room, eh? I mean, I guess I might as well. I mean, you just can't pass these up when you see them, can you? Because it's it's just like here, 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 here's some here's some ore for you. I'm like, okay, yeah, sure, I'll take it. Ooh, look at that. There we get. Yes, we got senium this time. Nice. Anti scallium. Ooh, almost missed that perfect jewel right. The perfect jewel right there. Yeah, that is why I need another satchel just for armor and jewels. I think. And just found a description as well. This vault is actually turning out really well. <laughs> Not finding any monoliths, however, which is a bit worrying. Finally, found one. And the fifth one, hopefully the sixth one will be in the next room. That will be literally perfect. And the sixth one, there we go. The reason why I want to get all these so badly is because I want the XP. Because I want to level up to level 40, and since we got a challenge room and a champion in that room, I'm guessing we'll get some pretty decent experience from that. And now that we completed the monoliths, hopefully that'll be a lot of XP as well. But now that I got all of them, I think I'm going to head back to the starter room, loot that because I definitely didn't do that, and then head right back through with about 10 seconds remaining. Yeah. And uh, boom. Nice. And uh, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. That was a vault successfully run. 28 seconds remaining. That's not too bad. I'm happy with that. All right. 21,000 XP loot information. We are alive 140 and only looted 70 chests. Well, we did get also a, um, what's it called? A, a dungeon and, a, and everything. So that I will take. We only leveled up once. Huh. Interesting. I mean, I won't complain. Uh, all right, let me get situated here and also sleep so we don't get some sort of weird creeper attack. 
And first things first I'm going to do is upgrade my strength even more to the max. But now I'm just going to add an extra chest here just for the, the, the new jewels that we're getting. I mean, look at these. Some of these are actually not too bad. Copiously on that one and ornate and uh, ornate affinity and soul bound on that one. Not too bad. I really need to go through all of these because uh, <laughs> it's a pain. And we got an inscription as well. Really, really happy about that. Wow, look at all this. So much uh, vault gear. I'm going to add it in here for now, then we will take a look at it all uh, later. Uh, some of it I probably will not need. And I mean, look at all these swords as well. We also got a bit of lemon. Wow. And the Xenium, of course, really, really nice. Two of these, which hopefully get... Nope, nothing. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> we also got a ton of different focuses. We almost have 200 wild focuses. And we now have three fundamental focuses in general. And we got an ornate chest scroll. Not too bad. That can be added into here. Overall, I think that this was a pretty successful run. Now, I do, of course, have to open... I did again, again didn't I? I do, of course, have to open this uh let's see what we got uh not too bad we got some stuff okay i guess it's time to look through all of this stuff right here i'm just gonna go ahead and go down right click this thing right here yikes and then go through it uh once i immediately don't care about them that is an absolutely horribly sort compared so nope anything that is like gray basically i don't want because i have like better stuff I'm going to wait with the magnets because I do need to take a look at that. Um, that's scrappy. This is common, though. Um, mine is currently scrappy. This is common. Not as good, though, still. Eh. I'm, 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 I'm just going to scrap stuff that I really don't think is worth it here. Oh. Oh, wow. Um, this is good. <laughs> I'm just gonna add that to there, um, because that's that's a that's a yeah, that's a helmet. Um, definitely want to reroll the prefixes, I think, but I mean it's pretty decent. Not gonna lie. All right, overall, not too overwhelming. I think mine is still better than most of the stuff that I got. So here's the interesting part. This, uh, my current uh magnet doesn't actually have. Uh, copiously, but this one does, though. Ooh, that's extra mining speed. The range is a bit meh, though. This does have copiously and is closer to the mining speed. Also, velocity is higher on both of these. Velocity is really higher on this, plus the mining speed, and the range is much better. Um, I might switch, actually. I'm going to scrap these two, because they're not worth it, I don't think. But these two, on the other hand... This one, mm, I don't know, this one is epic, this is just common, but like the range, and we do, mm, I could reroll these prefixes and get potentially something better than this, I actually realize. Plus it can't be repaired. Yeah, actually, no, I'm going to scrap this instead, then I'm going to try and reroll this to see what, something like that. You know what, I'll take it. <laughs> and we can repair it, it has plenty of repair slots, so you know what, I'm going to keep that for now. This helmet, though, definitely want to reroll these prefixes and also get an extra suffix. Increased damage, attack damage. I really, really do want health because that's a pretty high roll there. And extra armor wouldn't be bad either. So I'm just going to do this for a while. <laughs> uh, and then I'll be back. That's actually not bad. That's actually not bad. That is 14 armor plus 5 health, so a little bit less health, but more armor, and that's a high roll as well. That's a max roll. Uh, extra, more item rarity and also more uh, mana regen. I think I'm actually going to go with this. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually switching here. This is a pretty decent helmet. Yeah. Bye, old helmet. Don't need you anymore. <laughs> Okay, I am doing something here. I have just made four new pouches and I'm going to convert them into double pouches in just a second here because I want to have one double pouch for uh, stuff like gems and armor. So it actually goes in there instead of the overflow pouch, which is the other one that is just for random blocks. And then I think I'm going to be spending quite a few research points. You may argue that I could spend my knowledge points at a lot of different things like power, 
uh, even Torchmaster and potions especially, uh, botany parties, piglins, these villages. And while I do agree, one thing that is actually starting to bug me a little bit is actually the auto feeding. Um, that is going to increase the price for everything though. I would like bigger satchels or pouches I should say, but that can always wait. I really, really do feel like auto feeding is something that I should go for. I'm going to spend the time here making the pouches and setting the button up, etc. Um, to think about it because it, it is very expensive, but I think it is something that I would actually benefit a lot from because I do spend a lot of time just uh, eating when I could be running, for example. So yeah, I'm going to think it over real quick. So I should yeah, I should be able to do this right here. So I removed everything. So now I want to find things like relic booster packs again, and I can drag them into different slots. And that means I can also start adding stuff that I maybe forgot to add here or that are being introduced. So I'm actually pretty happy to have extra slots here. Um, don't know if this is the right slot to save to, but I'm gonna do it anyway. And I think there's another setting where, yeah, so if I just set it to match backpack contents, it's only going to pick this up, even though there's free slots here. If there's overflow of any of this, it will drop it down here. I like that feature a lot, actually. All right, I did stuff, some stuff. Actually, a lot of stuff. Basically, we now have five satchels in total. So we have these two that we have been running with for some time now, but now we also have an overflow pouch, which also has the pickup upgrade. We have this double pouch, which I can't name because uh, Anvil broke, uh, but this is going to be dedicated for jewels and armor. So that is really cool. That has a pickup uh, upgrade as well. And then this pouch right here, dedicated to running uh, seal of the hunter. This is scavengers, basically. And then we have this one, this black one right here. This is for running scavengers because every single scavenger item is in here. I don't have to look through it in my overflow chest. I can have a very clear view of what I have gathered so far in this one right here, which I absolutely love. Now, I'm going to be doing something that, yeah, I thought it over and I'm actually going to go ahead and do this. However, we're going to do it in the morning because I maybe I need to sleep on it just a second more. I know it is extremely expensive, but I think it is actually going to be worth it. Um, it may not seem like a lot, but I really, really do want this thing. And so I'm getting it. Yeah, there we go. I, I can't go back now. Plus, I mean, I, al I already have all the ingredients to make it in here, except for this thing, because I need nine of these, which is a lot. But then now I can actually go ahead and make this thing. Boom. Just like that. Perfectly. And yeah, that that did cost me a lot to make. Um, I really hope that this is, <laughs> this is a good investment. Now, if we take a look into this double pouch, we already have some vault suites and I'm just going to have to add the feeding upgrade to that. And that should, in theory, keep me uh, full at, at all times. And now I want to run that. Oh, I didn't see. Yeah, listen, guys, you can pass on through. I'm just going to add this here. Then I'm going to do some farming because apparently I need carrots and oh, no, slime bowls. Yeah, you guys stay right there. I'm gonna be busy for a while. I, 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 yeah, I'm, I have work to do. Yep, that's only six slime balls. Dang it. <laughs> and I just harvested the carrots. Oh, no. Oh, there we go. <laughs> that, it actually, it actually works. Um, I, you guys are actually attacking, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, you're attacking. Ow, okay, I'm gonna disable you because you're gonna pick up everything else and... I have bad omen. I listen. I I didn't do anything. I I literally did nothing. <laughs> Fine. Uh, let's get it over with. Yep. Get get it over with. It's not like you have a chance anyway. I missed. Be, be gone. Thank you. Okay. Only three of them. Wow. That's that surprised me. I think I need to go on like a mining expedition or something soon because I'm running low on redstone, gold, iron, copper. It's not looking too good, ladies and gentlemen. Um, yeah, I really need more resources. Oh, I fucked. 
forgot about that. Um, yeah, I was going over to the swamp over here. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, I did say I needed animals, right? Oh, boy. Yeah, I'm gonna have to help out, aren't I? Listen, if I can't deal with a simple, simple raid, then I really shouldn't be allowed to run vaults. <laughs> it's that simple, really. I mean, besides that, this village is really, really cool. Honestly. All right, let's get this over with. All right, well, I think that this is potentially the second last wave. Could also be the last one, but I don't think so. Two remaining. Yeah, where's uh, that, that's you? Oh, there we go. And was that it? Yeah, that was the final one. And I mean, at least we got a choice about for dying, a couple of saddles, and a bunch of crossbows as well, which I really don't care much about. But the emeralds and gunpowder and stuff, I will take it actually. And now that it's nighttime, hopefully I can get some slimes. It is not a full moon, unfortunately, but hopefully. We will get some slime spawning in anyway. And the sun is coming up, ladies and gentlemen, and there is no slime to be found. It looks like that I might have to wait for another night. <laughs> oh dear. Finally, 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 it's not a full-size one, but hopefully... Okay, 12. I still... <laughs> this, is, this is the second night. I, I just need four more slime balls, and then I, I I really, 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 really need to find a better way of getting this slime, because I, I need some sort of farm, either a slime farm or a mob farm where I can grind, like, multiple of the mob drops or something, because this is, <laughs> this is becoming quite a hassle, so I think that needs to be the next objective if possible. If this one tiny, okay. tiny slime gives me what I need, I will be so happy. I have 13, I need three. I got one. <laughs> and look at the moon! We were supposed to have a full moon, but nothing happened. I, uh, that... This is taking so long. Getting to this point has taken so long probably near an hour to be honest okay yeah i better okay yep yep finally okay i am going to place down this here swamp uh sigh there okay i am happy i oh boy yeah that 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 was a lot but we did we did it <laughs> Woo! I mean, we got a bunch of other stuff as well, so it, I, I guess it's fine. It, it's fine. 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 And boom! Finally, we are here. A scavenger hunt crystal. That took a while, but we are now ready. I think I just need to grab my equipment, such as this stuff right here, and then I do believe that we are ready. These just need to be in my inventory. Everything should be working just fine. Except that I do need to activate this. And with that, I think we're good to go. And of course, these, both of these item discoveries are things related to the scavenger. So hopefully, we will actually get that when we head on through. So, without any further ado, I feel like I missed something. I don't think so. Let's go. Um, is it just me, or does that feel extremely easy? One skeleton ribcage. One cracked pearl and one zombie brain. I, f I think the cracked pearl, the, th the green text is the uh, hardest stuff to get, I think. I don't know what the purple stuff is, but maybe that's going to be difficult. I, I don't know. I guess we're going to, uh, to find out. But so I need ores, living chests, and coin piles. Got it. Oh, wow, this POI is pretty. I don't think I've ever seen it before. That's... This is nice. And I believe red scrolls are one of the uh, rip page and goblet. Nope, never mind. Rip page and goblet. So that means wooden chest as well. Got it. Oh, as in right here. Oh, the eye. Those ghosts are so tough. Wow. Okay, I can already tell you right now that the auto feeding thing is so good. <laughs> I mean, I just need to make sure that there's always food in this one, but from by just by running vaults. 
like I'll get I'll get food like up there and yeah it's it's great I love it there we go we got some ripped pages not bad not bad though I do need to really prioritize on getting the stuff that I need to complete this vault in specific yes all right we got an ore piece please go away we have an ore POI and a corn POI as well. Now, oh, and, and another one. Okay. Please give me the skeleton rib cage. That would be great. No? Okay. I mean, I'll take even more gilded chests, obviously. Oh, hi. Bone shards. No. Uh, oh, living chests. Oh, that's amazing. That's amazing. Please go away. All right. Give me what I need. Zombie brain. That would be uh, poison. Okay. I guess. That, I guess you can give me that too. Now I need that cracked pearl, please, over here. That would be ideal. Uh, cracked script, but no cracked pearl. Yet, maybe. Maybe. No, don't want to miss a single coin pile. Also, are these... Uh, uh, well, I guess I'll find out at home. Uh, wow, we're getting a lot of stuff. I'm going to get these because I do believe that they can be turned into... Um, into their actual stuff. We'll check that back home. Uh, but so far, I actually have this. Set. Ah, right. So it's all going in here because. Okay. Oh, hi. Right. Uh. Hmm. I don't know how to counter that actually. Now that I think about it. Oh, that's one bounty completed. Very nice. Just needs a couple more ripped pages. Ooh. Just about landed that hotkey. Yeah, go away, please. Go away. Oh, ores. Oh, we actually got it. The rip cage. All right, that is one of the uh, of the things acquired. Oh, and that's living chest. Yeet. And please land. Nice. Okay, so that is one of the things required. Very good indeed. Oh, boy. Oh, dear me. Hi, everyone. Hi, hi, hi. Yeah, yeah. That's a lot of yeah. But this sword is absolutely... <laughs> Violating them. <laughs> That's amazing. Okay, what did I need from this? I forgot. Brain, zombie brain. Right. That should be doable. Maybe. Ooh, an inscription. I mean, I'll take it. I will take it. Uh, nothing else, though, of interest. What is... Ooh, yes. Yes. Perfect. Literally. Come on. I might miss if I pick up the zombie brain, but nope, never mind. Yep, that is. I almost missed it. Nice. Uh, I don't feel like that it is a good idea to skip this room, though. I. Oh, ow. I feel like I definitely need to loot all of this. <laughs> because I, I think this might be my. The first room of this. Uh, of this thing that I found, the mushroom room. I think it might be the first time I found it. I just need to get rid of the imposters that are trying to ruin my day. Don't worry, the tr the the slimes already tried that. <laughs> I mean, when you get an opportunity like this, you do kind of just have to grab it because yeah, it's it's just great. <laughs> okay, so I have the zombie brain confirmed. I have the skeleton rib cage. I just now need to not fall on these, and then need to get a bunch of coin piles and get the cracked pearl. I mean, so far, so good. Oh, wow. That's a lot of wooden chests here. I mean, I do need it for my bounty, so... I guess I'll do it. I mean, that's a ripped page right there, which is what I need, so... Might as well take this. I'm sorry, what even is that PY? I literally cannot see what it... What it contains. There's... Nothing? Is that... I don't think I've ever seen that. <laughs> 11 minutes. I really, really need a coin pile right about now. Come on, coin piles, please. No, I'm, get I'm getting so many gilded chests, which normally wouldn't be a problem. In fact, it would be most welcome at times. But just this time, I really, really want coins out of everything. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm going to actually go ahead and turn the stuff in that I already have, if I could find it in this. Oh yeah, because that is now full, this is going to start uh, counting, and we have four zombie brains. Wow, that that's a lot, but put that in. Um, any coins? Yes, there's coins down there. 
Keep going here. Please. Please. Crack bow. <gasps> we actually got it. We actually got it. <laughs> we actually have to crack pearl. Okay, that is brilliant. So now, I don't need to stress about things. Okay, so we know that this thing is in here. We can hold down shift and right click with the compass. And now I have seven minutes and maybe a little bit more time because I do believe that I have kiwis in here somewhere. Uh, yes, I do have nine kiwis and I think I have 48 as well in my shulker box. So now I can just loot. Oh, that feels good to have that done. That, wow. I think that, I think green is the rarest rarity or the, the highest rarity. What, what would that be called? Highest rarity? Rarest rarity? Biggest rarity? The rarest of the colors, I'm not sure. But wow. I'm just, I haven't even been getting that many coin piles. The fact that we got that that time, that was not bad at all. Uh, hi. Hi, yeah, hi. Um, oh, I missed the javelin. Okay, there we go. Oh, that wasn't actually too bad. I, I wasn't worried. You were worried. And ooh, the rip pages. Yeah, I need to focus on some chests. I really want to get this this vault run. That would be great. So we can get a new set of bounties next time. So if I could get those, that's at least one. That's good. So I need four more. Got it. I love that effect because I can just jump and take like minimal amount of fall damage. That is really really good. And another ripped page, so that brings us down to three. Nope, two. Oh, this is looking good, ladies and gentlemen. This is looking good. A completed objective, two completed bounties as well. Not bad. Ooh, factory. Uh, nope, gonna skip it. Gonna skip it. I don't think it has uh, stuff that I really need. At least I'm finding a lot of these so that I don't have to go back. That means I can loot a lot more. Come on, rip page, yes, we're just missing one. No, <laughs> please, just give me, give me one more. Can you be so kind? That would be great, please. And there we go, bounty complete. Awesome. Two trap chests right next to each other. That is unfortunate. Uh, this is a pickle, actually. Nah, I'm fine. Everything's fine. Well, I mean, with four minutes remaining and that bounty, both bounties completed, I can uh, take a look around, see what uh, what might be around. Maybe some really cool rooms that I will have then 30 seconds to loot. I don't know. All right, and with 30 seconds remaining, I think it is time to submit that in right there. Not a bad run whatsoever. We completed actually quite a lot in there. Or in here, I should say, because I haven't actually teleported yet. In three, two, and one. Yeah, there we go. Okay, despite it actually being a vault where I rushed a lot, 44,000 XP plus a scavenger crate, of course. We unalived 200 mobs and looted 178 chests. <laughs> I, I'll take that. And we even leveled up twice. That, I... I'm very happy with those results. <laughs> That's really good. And we got an inscription as well. So now we have two empty ones, one on 5% and one on 6%. Now it's annoying that this thing didn't actually work. Hmm. There is a filter upgrade. Filters items piped in and or out of backpack. I don't know if this would do it, but I am willing to try it out actually. Well, that doesn't really seem to do much. So if I do that, it, yeah, it doesn't even count for that. Okay, ne never mind. That was a waste of materials. But other than that, the overflow chest worked pretty well. We even got a, a nice jewel in there and some uh, some diamonds and whatnot. But of course, that is not the most interesting of the pouches. This one is. We didn't get that much gear, which is fine. But we did get a bunch of different jewels, and wow, that's a lot. Uh, yeah, not bad. I will take it as a victory. This magnet is meh, the shield is not as good, so immediately that could just be smelted down. And we have the miscellaneous here, we did get a repair core, quite a few coins as well, and a few focuses. But the one I'm most interested in is of course this one, 13 relic booster packs. Not bad, a couple of gems here and there, or although pretty good, not too bad. Uh, not the biggest hole though, however. 
but still not too bad at all. And 17 knowledge shards is not too bad either, because, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to need to save up on those for, uh, <laughs> for future projects. Now, please, can we have, yep, one, two. Not bad. Question is, do we have these already? Please have... Okay, one is a duplicate, one is not. That is the Richardy set, which I don't think I have yet. So overall, that is not too bad either. Finally, though, we of course have... I keep doing it, don't I? Finally, though, we of course have this, which has a lot of cool stuff, it seems. Uh, two shields, a one, three shields, a wand, an unidentified relic thing, and a helmet... Uh, and a bunch of different jewels that are not too bad either. Oh, is that, is that a full moon? That might be a full moon. Maybe, maybe, I, I don't know. <laughs> oh, four, uh, four vault platinum. Wow. Not bad. Let's quickly see what this is. And that is from the dragon relics. Uh, it's a duplicate. Uh, of course. Of course it's a duplicate. Of course. And it really wants to give me these coconuts, don't it? Uh, that is not bad, though. But still, and I, I like my current one. I don't think I'm going to replace it anytime soon unless I get something really, really good. Wait, so far this isn't good enough to replace it. And I don't use one, so I don't even want to look at them. <laughs> Regarding the skill points, though, um... Lucky hit. I, f I feel like I'm doing a good amount of damage. I could put one point into ethereal here. But I don't know if I should pick something else maybe. Like Mega Jump is probably good. Rampage is probably really good as well. I don't know though what I should pick. Tell you what ladies and gentlemen, I have two unspent skill points. Let me know what you think I should use them for down below in the comments. That would greatly help me out but i think that's going to wrap up this episode i hope it's not too long but uh, yeah today was an interesting one we got the auto feeding which by the way it was really really good because it made me be able to focus on the vault instead of having to eat every other second which is a really nice thing so i think overall it was worth it can i hit him nope oh shot <laughs> But yeah, hope you enjoyed. Uh, again, let me know if there's anything with that satchel. I'll do some research as well. But if you know anything, please do let me know down below in the comments. It would be greatly appreciated. That would really make me happy if I can actually get those pouches to work the way I want them to. And uh, yeah. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We almost forgot. Claim reward, claim reward. And is there anything in here? Not really. And let's do this. And boom, we no longer have an emerald shortage. <laughs> Not bad. That is a little bit pricey though when it comes to a crystal and this is not that great so yeah bye bye but yes ladies and gentlemen hope you enjoyed the video if you did be sure to leave it a like again comment down below all those things and oh dear me that i'm not dealing with that hope you enjoyed and i hope to see you next time have a wonderful day and until next time goodbye <laughs> please don't come in here that yeah that's what you get yeah uh -huh. uh. see you next time